Hi everyone, um, my name is Sasha and welcome to my channel. Um, today I thought I would do a makeup tutorial but something a little bit different in my opinion. Um, everyone's getting super excited for the new Infinity Wars to come out in cinemas so I thought I would do like an inspired makeup look. Um, I was thinking Iron Man so I thought we'll stick with our reds and golds like Iron Man and um, see how the makeup turns out. I'm actually really excited. Uh, I've got all my makeup laid out here so I think I'll just um, jump straight into it. So I always just grab my Urban Decay Eye Primer. So I'm just concealing my eyes um, because they're quite discolored and they've got like a few veins so we shall conceal those and then after that I like to go in with my powder so I'll just grab a brush and powder my base down I don't usually do my eyes first I really like doing my base before my eyes but um because I'll be using like reds and golds, I feel like there might be a little bit of fallout. Um, I might actually zoom in. Oh my god, my my brows. Okay, <laughs> so um, we're gonna dip into uh, like an orangey kind of shade, and we're gonna use that as a transition color. I need a little mirror. Look down and pop that right there in the crease So I just like to gradually keep adding, so I'll go back in the other eye. Then I'm gonna go in with um, this ready color underneath. And by the way, I'm using the Morphe 35 Fairy palette, I think it's called. And I'm just gonna place that red right in the same place I put the orange. That should be cool. Um, I think I might go in with the gold now. So I'm going to actually cut my crease. Um, I don't always cut my crease, but I feel like for this look, it'd look pretty cool. So why not? I'm using like a little real technique brush. What I like to do is just grab some on the brush from the applicator. And then Kind of like outline where I want the gold. Then I'm going to go into my Huda palette. I'm going to go into my Huda palette and I'm going to take, oh, I'm thinking the shade 24K. So it looks like that one. I actually haven't used this shade, so I'm interested to see how it transfers onto the eye. Um, but 
So what I like to do with these shades is just like rub my finger in it and press. Oh, this is amazing. Can you see that? Oh. Oh my god, it looks amazing. I love it. Um, I'm going to go in with a pencil brush and I'm going to go back into the red shade from my Morphe 35O palette. And I'm going to try and blend the top parts, the eye, because I feel like they're too harsh for my liking. So I'm just going to blend them. I want it to show that there's a cut crease, but at the same time, I want it to like still blend. That side just looks like more finished off. In my opinion, it does. I'm going to go back in with the 24K shade and press a little bit more on top. Because I'm wanting it to be like quite prominent on the eye. So I'm going to go into my Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette this time and I'm going to pick up like that kind of burgundy shade, like cranberry burgundy shade. Um, and maybe deepen it just a tiny bit. I don't want it to be like too much, but I want still a little bit of depth on the outer corner. And then I might get back in with my fluffy brush and then grab that orangey kind of shade that we grabbed at the start and just blend the top part in. I don't know if I should do some like black liner. I'm feeling black liner, but like pencil liner smoked out. So I want to put lashes on. Just like that. There's a really thin line. Grab a smudgy brush. And I'm going to pick up um, Black Truffle in the Huda palette. just like gently wiggle my brush over the black liner but like move it upwards cool um so i think i'm gonna put some mascara on and my lashes and then i'll be right back Okay, so lashes are on and I'm really happy with the way it looks so far. I think it looks really cool. Um, so now I'm going to do my face. Going in with the Too Faced Hangover Primer. Pump that. Um, and for those that know me, know that I'm loving. <laughs> I love this foundation so much. It's the Bare Minerals Bare Pro um, Foundation and I love it. I'm using it on a beauty blender and it's really weird because I don't use a lot of my foundations on a beauty blender but I love the way this looks with a sponge. Beautiful. So then I'm going to go in with my concealer, which I will mix the 
uh, Maybelline Age Rewind with a little bit of my um, Naked Skin from Urban Decay. <laughs> so then I'm just going to set the under eyes with a bit of powder. Then I'm going to set the rest of the face with my Astralis powder, which I love. Before I do my bronzer and stuff, I think I might do my brows. So, I'm going to go in with the um, Hourglass pencil. Awesome. So then I will go in with my Laguna bronzer. I'm using like my jumbo one. How cool. Um, with a big like powder brush. And I like to just bronze the face. I'm not going to do a lot of contouring. I just feel like bronzing today. Awesome. And then with the cheeks, I'm thinking of keeping it quite um, similar to the eye. I'm thinking Frenzy Nars. And you just swirl the colors together. And it gives you like a really pretty, like iridescent cheek. And I can even take up like the other side and just like pat that on my high points. I might go back onto my eyes. I just want to finish the eye area with it. Um, with the red and just go underneath the eye. I bring the red all the way across this time. And then go in with the darker red and pop that on top. And to finish off, I was thinking of a red lippy. Yeah, that's still red lip. <laughs> so I'm just going to go in with my Essence Lip Liner and line away. I just remembered I put on... um. Malin lip balm, so my lip might be a little bit more glossy than matte, which is fine. I'm gonna go back with the Stila Liquid Lip in Esso, my favorite red of literally all time. Oh. Oh, I wish my friend Holly was here to do my lips. Mm. Like literally, she did my lips for like a NARS mask class and they were perfect. Like my lips have never looked that perfect before. But this will have to do. I think they look all right. So that I think is my final look. I want to add a little, little bit more blush though. I want more color on the cheeks to match the vibe. I think that's looking better. Awesome. I'm pretty happy with the way that this has turned out, to be totally honest with everyone. Okay. I'm going to spray my face to grab my OMDK set spray. And I'm just going to set a little bit. So if I'm not the um, female version of Iron Man, I don't know who is. So that is the finished look. I think I might zoom you in to have a looky at the final product. Oh, 
Um, so that is the end of my video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I had so much fun making this. I feel like making all the Avengers. If you did enjoy the video, please give it like a big thumbs up and um, leave comments if you have any other ideas. I don't know. I've got like 14 subscribers at the moment, so that's pretty exciting. Um, yeah, um, hope to see you in my next video. Have a lovely day um, and I'll see you soon. Bye. Mwah.